We did this about the uh, uh, baseball also. The baseball. Uh, the baseball. We did this about the baseball. Um, and now uh, we've been asked to do it about basketball. So with very little preparation. Let's do it. No preparation. Here's basketball relevancy. Rick, fire away. No, I want you to try to name all the teams first. Uh, I want me to name all the basketball teams. By the way, huge NBA fan. But like on the spur of the moment, naming all 30 NBA teams might be a little tricky. I'm just going to name them because we have other stories to do. Okay, let's start with Chicago. The Bulls are obviously relevant. Obviously. Even, without, even without Michael Jordan, it's a relevant team. It's very Chicago, great sports town. All teams in Chicago are relevant. Um, even the Chicago Fire? The Chicago Wolves? Those aren't, those, what are those? Those are like minor league teams? Those are sports teams. Uh, the Miami Heat? No, they're not. The Miami Heat are painfully, to me, I, I have to say, relevant. They made such an impact last year in free agency that they now matter. They didn't until but last year. I thought year. you said in the NFL segment that free agency doesn't matter. It might not matter when you change the whole discussion about free agency and people around the country care what the Heat do, whether they win or lose, and know who they are. Even if they're not basketball fans, they became relevant. They made such an impact, did such a remarkable thing that they've become relevant. But they weren't relevant until then, even with the title. The Indiana Pacers. I definitely have to say yes. Yeah, they made I, a big I'll, comeback. I'll say yes, and, and even though the state is a basketball state, they don't love their they don't love their professional basketball like they do their college basketball. But I'll give you the Pacers. Uh, yeah, I'd probably go with that too, actually. Even though it's totally split between Purdue and Indiana, Boston Celtics definitely relevant. Yeah, obviously. No, no argument yeah. there. Uh, Atlanta Hawks. Nope. Nope, not even close. Not even worth mentioning. <laughs> Move on. It's amazing how much you hate Atlanta. I don't hate Falcons Atlanta. They're not, not relevant. relevant. Nobody pay. cares. Nobody goes to they, the They almost move constantly. They can't get an ownership settled. Nobody in Atlanta cares. No one. And they have a $100 million player in Joe That's Johnson. right. Yeah, and a great one. A really good one. <laughs> All right, go on. What do we got? Orlando Magic. Not even no. vaguely. Not even a whiff of relevancy. Even through the Shaquille O'Neal phase and all that? That helps. He if he'd stayed. Penny Hardaway? Oh, no? yeah, the Penny Hardaway. I forgot about Penny Hardaway. Yeah, they're relevant. Come on. <laughs> it's Penny. No, they're not relevant. They're more relevant than the Hawks, but they're irrelevant. The best thing that ever happened to Penny Hardaway was Chris Rock doing Little Penny. Uh, that was funny. Yeah, the last time great. the Atlanta Hawks were relevant, uh, by the way, Larry Drew and Down Roundfield were uh, the forwards. What do you got? What's Showing next? your old timer. timer -ness. I'd say New York Knicks, yeah, obviously. Uh, perhaps the most relevant, one of the most relevant teams in sports. Who's the most relevant team in sports? I don't know. I'd have to think about it. The Knicks. Is, Yankees? Yeah, Yankees, Knicks, Cowboys. Red Sox. You know, those Cubs, are. Cubs, Bulls. Uh, now, I don't think the Bulls aren't at that level. Of the Bulls oh. aren't at the Yankees, Knicks, Cowboys level. But they're in this right below that. I would say they're definitely above the Cowboys. No, the Cowboys are maybe one. The Cowboys might be one. The Cowboys are literally America's team. All right, we have to get through this. Philadelphia 76ers. Relevant. Really? Yeah. Interesting. Milwaukee Bucks. Sorry. <laughs> Detroit Pistons. Relevant, definitely. How come? How come? Oh, it's the Pistons. They, they have a signature style that you associate with the team, even if the team no longer plays that style, woven into the fabric of Detroit, of Michigan. People care about them. They're like the Red Wings. They matter. New Jersey Nets. <laughs> <laughs> Next. <No. laughs> Such an asshole. Uh, Toronto. The, rap the Raptors. Okay. Come on. Come on. Did you get that, Mark? Yeah. Did you get that finger wave? Uh, Cleveland Cavaliers. No, I'm afraid not. The Washington Bullets. I mean, if they were the Bullets, because, again, woven into the fabric of the city, the city cares a lot about them, the name change devastating, and then they just proceed to make personnel moves that not, that not only don't help the team, they don't even seem to exist. Uh, and even the breakup with Jordan was awkward when he came back. I'm afraid they've done the remarkable and they have made themselves irrelevant. They could get it back, they could start by changing the name back. Charlotte Bobcats. Anyways, San Antonio Spurs. Yeah, relevant. Thunder. Uh, I'm, you know, I'm tempted to say no because of the move and they play in a ridiculous place that should not have a national sports team. It's a great team. place, though. It's like a college town. Right. Because it's a college town and they've sort of, that whole town has Close embraced knit. them. And because they are so good, being good can matter in a particular moment. 
I will give them relevancy, but it's very close. The Lakers. And the Sonics were so real. Lakers, obviously. Clippers. No. Grizzlies. Uh, Clippers, no. Grizzlies, no. <laughs> Memphis Grizzlies. <laughs> it's funny to say. Why? <laughs> They're not relevant. What it's about a... if they stayed in Vancouver? Yeah, if they stayed in Vancouver, they'd be relevant. Really? No, they had no chance of relevancy anywhere. They were doomed from the start. Even with Bryant Reeves? <laughs> Even with big country. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Dallas Mavericks. Winning the title definitely helps. That doesn't, it helps, but uh, I tell you what makes them relevant, I think more than anything else, is Mark Cuban. So I think they're relevant. Uh, Denver Nuggets. Yeah, old school. They matter. They matter in Denver. They're, they're one of the least relevant, relevant teams, but I'll give them relevancy. Would they be even more relevant if they kept the old jerseys? Yeah, all of those things would help. And by the way, I could be talked out of Denver's relevancy in five seconds. I'm really close. They're not relevant. They're close, but I'll give them relevance. Just kidding. I think they're relevant. Phoenix Suns. No. Mm, no? No. No. I mean, you know, great player. No one cares. It doesn't, it's just, it's a, it's a, no, no. There's nothing, there's not, other than Steve Nash, there's nothing there of note of, and that's a weird community to begin with. You know, it's a weird town. It doesn't sort of, it doesn't come around any, I don't think there's one relevant sports team in the, in the Valley. I was thinking, did Jason Kidd get drafted by the Suns? But he got drafted by the Mavericks and then went to the Suns. And then back. In, in 96. Uh, I think he was there for like five years. Uh, Utah Jazz. I would say, yeah. Jerry Sloan definitely put them on the map. They're called the Utah Jazz. Just because of that, very irrelevant. Really? They're close. I'm Come torn. On. It's cool. Come it seems on. like the Jazz, the Nuggets, and the Suns. I mean, if they're relevant, they're barely, barely relevant. Houston Rockets. Yes. Whew, Jesus. Yeah, yes. I'll give it to them. Yeah. Absolutely. Portland Trailblazers. Yeah, definitely. Really? Yeah, yeah. There's nothing. I mean, like Oklahoma City, that town loves that team, yeah, embraces that team. No matter what, they love that team. Timberwolves. Come on. Golden State Warriors. No. It's a pity. They should be, but they're not. They're trying. Well, the why did, the can, city back, the, getting the, that, that logo back helps, but they're not. They're, riddle, riddle me this. Why the f yeah, did they trade Monte Ellis? Uh, I assume for space to build going forward. They made themselves less good this year. He's a top but, five scorer in the league. Yeah, I know, but they're a 28-win they're a team with Monte Ellis. I don't know. I, I don't think they got enough in Andrew Bogut and whoever the hell they well, got. Well, they got the contract off the books. That's what they wanted well, off. The, the other thing that was happening was that, and we're almost done, is that he um, sent uh, cock shots to an employee of the Warriors. So It's always classy. Yeah, always. Um, Look, if you, there's two things you shouldn't do. Take a picture of your penis <laughs> and then send it, to some, send it to anyone, let alone send it to somebody you work with. Just a little life lesson there. Just when you do this, this moment, just take a step back. Don't take a picture of your penis. You're welcome. Ben sends those to me all the time. Sacramento Kings. No, not even a little. Not even going to be there, apparently. To sending me the picture or the Sacramento Kings? <laughs> Sacramento Kings irrelevant, obviously. And lastly, the New Orleans Hornets. No, not relevant. Okay. It's too bad, but they're not relevant. What does that leave? Do we, do we mark that down? I, I, I That's like half the league in the NBA is relevant. Okay. Um... Next. 